Hello everyone. So this is a video that will demonstrate how you can use the Sahode MIS for generation of certificates. So there are, there this website will be shared with everybody. Uh, in order to get your password for the first time, you will need to use the forgot password link and use the same email ID that you registered uh, in the Google form that was sent yesterday. So I will demonstrate this with the help of a test school. So I have a test school with an email ID and I'm going to use that. So uh, let's do the forgot password as well. So the first step, what you will do is you'll click the forgot password, put in your email address that you use for registration. Click on send. Right now this window does not close, but this should send out an email. So you can hit cancel and wait for the email to arrive. Just check my email. That took around 45 seconds. So you will get this email with the password. I'm going to use this password to log in now. That was my school. So save my password. So I have logged in as test school. And at this moment, there already the participation list for the WebEx uh, based uh, training has been uploaded in the system. So if I go to the events, I see the first training session already mentioned here, but from my school, test school, I don't have any participants. And this is because the school has not registered the email IDs of the teachers that are attending this event. So let me first do that. So in this case, I'll go to my teachers section and I will add the teachers. I'm going to add myself for now because I, and this, this should be, you should enter the email ID that the teacher is using on Webex. This is very important. Teachers must be using their Gmail ID and they are entering the name and Gmail ID there. Uh, please talk to the teachers and get that Gmail ID and put it over here and the name and that's it. So once you save it, then it will be able to map that data, the participation data automatically. And therefore it will become completely automated. You, nobody else has to do any updates or tell that a particular Gmail ID belongs to a particular user. So please talk to the teachers and update the email accordingly. And they should be, the teacher should be using the same Gmail ID henceforth for attending any other sessions. So I'm going to click on save here. Teacher has been created successfully close. The, you might want to give the password also to the teacher so that they can log in on this portal. So this portal is open to the principles for creating the uh, creating the teachers and once it is created the teachers can also log in and uh, download their certificates from here very soon we will have an auto mailer facility where it will be mailed accordingly right now we are not going for the auto mailer facility because we are not sure of the gmail ids that are being used once the teachers start using bona fide email ids in their webex sessions then we can start that mailer. But right now, the most safe bet would be that teachers log in and download their certificate from the Sahode MIS portal. We will share the actual link. Uh, don't use this link on the top. Now, if I look at my events now, after having created the teachers, I see that I have one participant participation because the teacher's email ID actually matches my participation data. So now 
assuming that you have given this email id to the teacher they can log in so i'm going to log out from here and log in as a teacher so as a teacher when i log in i i see events and i can see that i attended this particular event and i can proceed to download the pdf this is available all the time so any time uh, later the teacher can log in and click on this and download their pdf that is that's all that is there to the certificate generation system the system will be improved over time added more refinements will be added such as auto mailer that i spoke about but for now this is a functional system and uh, it will be applicable now for the upcoming events any uh, questions you may uh, send that to my uh, whatsapp number with a screenshot of what trouble you are facing uh, don't send it in the group you can send it to uh, me personally i am there on the group with my uh, phone uh, with my number 9341258015 thank you